Hey people, I know oh, you changed Blake because he's now happier, so whatever. Why wouldn't it be realistic? Not necessarily. Okay, guys, I know you guys probably been wanting me to upload something all day, but I just have not been feeling it. So I figured I would post these before I went to bed. What's going on? Joanne's in the hospital. She overdosed yesterday. What? They be swearing. They be so fucking shocked. She's fine now, but she doesn't want to talk to me. Why? I don't know, but I'll try to speak to her again after school. If Okay, so the art to tell me something. They let us change Blake's hair. She didn't even change shit, but her fucking hair and fucking mascara. Because Blake's happy or not. But bitch, if she happy, why the fuck is she still dressing like she going to go to fucking sleep? Ain't this Joanne place? Who the hell sold Joanne drugs? Probably Aldo ass. I didn't. Did it I? Mm-hmm. Anything to say? Oh, relax, like Liam. She just wanted to have some fun. Are you stupid? You know how hard it is for Joanne to stop everything. Well, was for Joanne to stop everything. How could you do this? She's not a child. She can take She can take her own decisions. She can make her own decisions. And business is business. You know that. Bitch. Bitch. <laughs> After school. What the fuck do you want? Hey, Blake, how are you today? Now it's not the time, Tyler. You better be nice to me, Blake. See, it's much... It's better when your mouth is shut. Well, when you shut your mouth. I'll see you tomorrow, Blake. Hey, what do you want? Please don't want to talk to me. We're friends. Friends? <laughs> that was before you let me down. I can explain. At first, I thought, yeah, she's in the middle of a trial. She's busy. But even after that, you were not there. You forgot me, and I and I lost everything because of you. I lost the love of my life because of our friendship. What are you talking about? I'm talking about Liam. What? Are you still in love with him? Of course I am. Bitch, what? We had something strong. Bitch, what? <laughs> he always told me that the problem wasn't me. He always told me that he didn't want to date anyone. And now look at him, acting like a perfect boyfriend. Why did he choose you over me? You don't even sleep with him. I thought I was doing the right thing because I thought we were friends. God, how I was wrong. I lost him and then you let me down. You were only using me to have him. Well, I can't believe she still has feelings for him. I had no idea. This is, bitch, this is unfair. This is so unfair. You told me that you were fine with it. That you didn't care about Liam anymore. You can't blame me. No one could ever blame you. You're perfect. You're the perfect little girl. Why are you so mean to me? Because I hate you. Oh, bitch, check you out. I hate you all. I hate all of you. No. You called me in the middle and I just told this simple stupid bitch. <sighs> Sorry, y'all. 
I just told some stupid ass that I was recording, so I don't understand why he would be calling me. That's my best friend, y'all. I sit in, in my room, crying for God knows how long. I was so hurt by her words. I thought we were friends. I felt so betrayed, too. Betrayed because I thought she didn't love Liam anymore. What if she decided to steal him from me? You should lock your door when you're alone. What's going on? Why are you crying? It's Joanne. She hates me. What are you talking about? Joanne loves you. You know that. Not anymore. I saw her today. She told me she hates me. Do you want to know why? It's because she's still in love with you. What? <laughs> That's insane, Blake. No, it's not. She loves you and she thinks you let I let her down. And you know what? She's right. Since the trial, I let her down. I was never there for her. I'm such a terrible friend, and now she thinks that I used her to have you. Hey, please calm down. What if she tried to date you? What are you talking about? I don't want to date her. I'm happy with you. No one can change that. She hates me. I lost my best friend, and it's all my fault. You need to know. You need to know that right now, Joanne is needy. It's the lack of uh, drugs. That's why she talks to you like that. She probably hates everyone right now. I don't know. Trust me. I know how it is. She needs professional help. Uh, I'm sure she doesn't mean a, a thing of what she said. I feel so guilty, Liam. Don't. It was her, her, it was her decision, not yours. I love her, Liam. I love her and I can't even help her. She needs professional help. You don't understand. She's pregnant. What? Agatha is an OBGYN. If she was in her bedroom the other day, that means that Joanne is pregnant. Are you sure? It doesn't see... I don't see any other possibility. We need to reason with her. She can't lead this life if she's expecting the baby. I'm going to talk to her. Wait here for, uh, Wait for me here. I'll be that soon. I hope she'll listen to you. Meanwhile. Can you believe it? He didn't even kiss me. It's like he doesn't care about me. What? Why did you just roll your eyes at me? Why do you want to date him so bad? The others say he's not a good guy. Who cares about what they say? I care. Blake told me to stay away from him and Stevie. Since when do you listen to this little idiot? She's just jealous because they're not together anymore. Jealous? She has Liam and he's hotter than Tyler. I don't think so. Girl, me neither, girl. Seriously, here. He lied to all of the school about her. He. That just irritated the fuck out of me, bruh. Like, I don't even want to post this fucking video no more. Like, that shit is stupid as fuck. Ugh. Please, I'm not black. I don't know how to satisfy a man. Oh, come on. What's wrong with you? They had a fight and he lied. But, so what? It doesn't mean anything. Maybe we don't know all the truth. Maybe there's more to the story than just a lie. You should get to know him better before doing anything with him. Please, en enough. I know what I'm doing. Let the little bitch be the next victim. Go ahead. Where is she? What are you doing here? Can you see my friend? Where is she? She's in isolation right now. She's a danger to herself. Can I see her? Follow me. What the fuck? What the fuck type of isolation y'all got? What? You can see her, but I'm not sure she wants to talk to you. Thank you. Hey, you. What are you doing here? I wanted to see you. Are you okay? Since when do you care about me? Please don't be like that. <laughs> no. <laughs> Niggas favorite shit to say don't be like that. Bitch, you don't be like that, bitch. Please, Joanne, don't reject me. 
why would I listen to you? Because I'm here to help you. To help me? Where the hell were you these last few months? Do I have to remind you that you are the one who uh, didn't want to talk to me? I know, I'm sorry. I don't care. It's too late now. Don't say that. I made a mistake, but I'm still here for you. Here for me. You're unbelievable, Liam. I hate you. I have nothing to say to you. I know you I know you don't hate me. Oh, you don't know anything. You're upset because you're needy. <laughs> you're not in your right mind. I'm perfectly fine. No, you're not. How could you use drugs again? After what happened to Julie, you promised you'd never do it again. This is none of you. this is not your business. Yes it is. You're my friend. I won't let you ruin your life. You and I were not friends. And you know it since the day you slapped me. <laughs> I'm sorry, Joanna. I was going through a hard time. I had just found out what happened to Blake. I was angry. I'm sorry, Joanne. It wasn't your fault. I just ne I needed someone to blame. That's not my problem. I hate you. I hate Blake. I hate everyone. That's not true. Yes, it is. How could you do this to me? You always told me that you didn't want to have a girlfriend that, that the problem was you. Then you let Blake... Uh, Wait, then you let me down to be with Blake. It's not my fault. I couldn't control it. I couldn't uh, know I was going to fall in love with her. Yeah, I guess I wasn't good enough for you. I was just your toy when you had nothing else to do. That's not true. You were my friend. You're uh, you're not just some random girl. Bruh. I, when, when I tell you, my phone is dead ass dry until I start fucking recording. Dead ass dry. Nobody hit me up. Shit. Nothing goes on on this fucking phone. It's dead ass dry legit. Okay. Anyway, but what you did to Blake, it's unfair. You told her that you had no problem with our relationship. You don't have the right to make her feel guilty now. Do you know that she's crying in her bedroom right now because you hurt her? Because you wanted to because she wanted to help you and you just yelled at her. She's not perfect, you know. I never said she was. I love her, that's all. There's nothing to explain. I'm sorry if you can't deal with that. Bitch, I ain't. Please, Joanne, stop acting like that. We're all here for you, whether you like it or not, and we're not gonna let you down. You need to get well. You need to stop everything. For you and for your baby. What? What are you? Wait. What are you talking about? I know that you're pregnant. Your doctor is Blake's great aunt. There's no baby. The doctor said there's no heartbeat. It's over. I'm sorry. I don't care anyway. Don't say that. I know it's not true. She about to cry. I know it. I'm such a mess. It's okay. Everything is going to be fine. You'll see. It's all my fault. You made a decision. Now you can learn from it. I'm a monster. No, you're not. Who's the father? I don't know. What? I slept with so many guys, I felt so alone. You're not alone anymore. I'm not going to let you down again. A few days later. I just wanted to talk to you. The I just wanted to tell you that I'm taking Blake out of town for the weekend. But she doesn't know it. That's great. Where are you going? Uh, we're going to Hawaii. Wow. I know, right? She needs it. She's so sad and she knows what happened to Joanne. Yeah, I know. We're leaving tonight. We'll be back on Sunday. Have a nice weekend. Why did you why, why did you just tell her fucking brother what did how was she? What did he have to do with anything? I don't know. She's in rehab. That's all I know. I hope she'll get better. Yeah, me too. She almost died. Can we visit her? No, the doctor said we can't see her for right for now. Um, I hope she'll get through this. Hey, Blake. I hope I get a chance to see you tomorrow at your brother's party. Ignore him. I'm not in the mood, Tyler. Don't say what the fuck is that? Blake, wait. Leave me alone, Tyler. 
I did what you wanted. Now stop harassing me. Fuck out of here. Yeah, but your brother and all his friends still hate us. What did you expect after you tried to rape me? I didn't try to rape you. You were okay with it. Are you kidding me? You drugged me. You're a psychopath, Tyler. You should be locked in jail. Hey, don't talk to me like that. You don't... Oh, wait. Don't you remember what I have on you? What, what do we have? You really want to see me go crazy, Tyler? I'm not afraid of you. You should be because next time you won't be so lucky. <laughs> Let's go, Blake. Bye, Tyler. I didn't know you were coming. I'm taking you out this weekend. What? Where are we going? It's a surprise. You just have to pack up your bags and we're we're leaving. You just have to pack your bags and we're leaving. Hey Tyler. Hey. Wow, I just heard the conversation. Well, I just had your conversation. It's great to see someone who's not afraid of Liam. Of course I'm not afraid. I'm a real man. You definitely are. So, I heard that you had something on Blake. What is it? I'm not going to tell you all my secrets. Oh, come on. You and I, we're the same. I'm hot. Wait, you're hot. I'm hot. We're popular. And most importantly, we both hate Blake. We could work together and make her life a living hell. You have a point, but I don't know if I can trust you. I promise I won't tell anyone. I just want to make her suffer. I hate her. I should have known that you were the only one who could help me. You're the smartest guy in the whole school. You got a point. Fine, I'm going to tell you. But this is must stay between us. I won't tell anyone. You have my word. I've got pictures of her. Pictures? Yeah, we took them when we were together. What kind of pictures are you talking about? Blake only uh Blake only wearing underwears. And if she doesn't do what I want, I'll release them. Wow, that's smart. I know. We never had sex, but at least I'm going to have them those pictures. Where do you keep them? In my laptop, of course. There's no one uh where uh here no one can delete them. You're so smart, Tyler. I know. I'm sorry, but I have to go. My parents are uh, waiting for me. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. You're so fucking stupid, Tyler. Where are we going? You can tell me now. We're going to Hawaii. I can't believe it. What about, uh, but what about Agatha and what's and uh and what about your boss of course i asked agatha first and she said i could take you out and i still have the right to go out vince doesn't control everything in my life thank you so much he got a little coin if he could afford to take a bitch to hawaii several hours later i'm so tired come on we're almost there Wow. It's beautiful. Bitch, I know y'all know ain't about to sleep in that fucking tree house. And, and here's our room. Bitch in the tree house. Oh, Liam is so beautiful. Oh, y'all can finally fuck now. I think this is what Liam was trying to get at. <sighs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. Wait, yeah, you're welcome, sweetheart. So are they gonna have sex or what? I couldn't believe it. I'm so happy to I was so happy to be here to spend the weekend with Liam. It's just the two of us. Uh oh, sorry. 
Okay. Um, as we were pretty tired, we went to bed and fell asleep quickly. <laughs> come here, come here. Where are you going? <laughs> For once, you're not wearing pants and a leather jacket, right? I love it. It suits you. Everything suits me, sweetheart. Now let's go. Have an amazing day. We went to the beach. We visited Isla. We ate in a beautiful restaurant. We went to the local market. Y'all did a lot of shit, girl. Just say that. And we saw the sunset. I think it was the happiest day of my life. What I didn't know is that it wasn't over. Liam had another surprise for me. You should take a shower and get dressed for dinner. Meet me down at the beach. Oh. Mm. Let's see what the hell is Liam's birthday gift. Ugh, I fucking hate that fucking dress. No, I don't want to wear Let's see what this is. Oh, I hate this dress even more. Oh, God. Two ugly ass dresses. This is her. Mm -hmm. Beautiful princess. Now, please take a seat. I can't believe you did all this for me. I would do anything for you. And he put so much effort into um, everything was perfect. He was perfect. This is our last night here. I wanted to. Uh, I wanted what's best. It's amazing, Liam. I wish we could stay here forever. Far from all those problems. Well, all of our problems. Far from his gang. He's such a great guy. He doesn't deserve to lead this life. We ate here. We talked for hours. I wanted this woman to last forever. I don't want to leave. I know, but we can't stay here forever. I know. We'll, we'll do it again. I promise. I love you. Um, you. You've changed my life. Clearly. I'm not the same person anymore. I'm not sad anymore. And it's all thanks to you. Girl. You always gotta bring up the dead dry shit. Bitch. Get over. you changed me too. I never thought I could love someone. And I don't regret it. Every day you make me happy. And I want to be, I want you to be my forever. Uh, um, what are you doing? Is he proposing? Suddenly he took out a ring out of his pocket. Ooh, look at that hand. Shit, ugly and hairy as fuck. <laughs> I love you and I know I always will. It's a, this is a promise ring. Okay, I promise to stay faithful to you no matter what. And one day when everything will be over... Then we'll be free to start a new life. I'll make you my wife. And I'll do everything I can to make you happy every single day of my life. To protect you and to love you until the day I die. Are you willing to stay with me forever, Blake? Are you willing to forgive me for my past sins? Can you promise me to stay with me 
Huh, to love me until the end. Shit, god damn. Yes. Ten times yes. Oh. He put the ring on, um, on my finger while he looked at me. Uh, I know it took him a lot of nerve to do that. The guy who had met, who I had met a year ago, who didn't want to open up to anyone was gone. I changed him, just like he changed me. I know we belong together. I'm crazy about you, Blake Turner. Then why didn't why did you stop kissing me? <laughs> he was an incredible kisser. I couldn't get enough of his lips. I could feel the desire grow inside of me. I deeply I was deeply in love with this boy. And I knew I was ready for the next step. I wasn't afraid anymore. He was the one. I wish you were my first. Let me be your last. Hey, right, bitch. Why would you say that? She just irritated the fuck out of me. It was the most beautiful night of my life. You finally had consensual sex. All my life, I thought I was going to end up alone. I thought no one would ever want me. I was so wrong. Liam saved me. And now the only thing that I want is to be his forever. Come on, don't make that face. Let's go. We don't want to miss our plane. few hours later, thank you so much for this weekend. You're welcome, Princess. What the hell was Agatha doing sitting there? Hey, Blake. Hey, Agatha. How was it? It was perfect. Thank you for letting me go. You're welcome. Do you want to eat something? You must be hungry. I'm good. Thank you. We ate in the plane. I just want to go to sleep. Well, I just want to sleep. Then good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. That night I went to bed and I fell asleep quickly. You always fall asleep fucking quickly. Thinking about Liam and about our perfect weekend. Hey guys. Hey sis. How's your weekend? Yeah, how was it? I want to know everything. It was perfect. What did you do? She went to Hawaii with her boyfriend. Oh. He's more than my boyfriend. He gave me a promise ring. He said he wanted to marry me one day. I'm so happy for you. Oh, meanwhile. Back at the damn trailers. Liam's point of view. to see me mm -hmm. I have a mission for you here's the address and here's a picture of the man I want him dead who is he what gang does he belong to he's not a gang member that's all you need to know I told you I don't kill innocent people you're gonna do what I want otherwise you know what will happen to you and your family you're not the boss here I am and you're going to do what I want, as usual. I want you to come uh, here right after it's done. He's really starting to get on my nerves. I'm sick of this life, but I don't have a choice. Anyway, I'm used to it now. 
each time it's the same process. Come, kill. I come, I kill, I clean. Tell myself that they deserve it because they're bad people, they're killers. Uh, but this time I don't even know who the guy or what he what he did to Vince. I don't like that. But it doesn't but it doesn't matter. I have no choice. This is a long episode, y'all. Shit, it's 30 fucking minutes. I'll, I'll just wait here until he goes out. And I'll do what I have to do. Sam, there's no doubt about it. I pull my, I pull out my gun. I shoot him in, the, uh, I shoot him and I oh, lay his body there. I have to disappear quickly. No one can, ask, no one can see me here. It's now or never. God damn it, Daddy. What the hell? Daddy, don't go. Daddy has to go to work, sweetheart. Sweetheart? I'll see you tonight, okay? Why would you call your son, sweetheart? Come on, let's go home now. Oh, you go home now. I'll see you tonight, Daddy. Alright, y'all, this is the last episode. We gotta wait for her to post the next one.